Who'd I just pass there? That you, good buddy? Tree top tall and wall to wall. Travis, you messed up some bitch. What you doing on my road? Well, hit on a gig, bud. I'm taking the shortcut past Silent Hill. Stop up for coffee as soon as I hit Brahms. I'm beat. Bad dreams still keeping you awake. I told you, man, a girl or two would go a long way. Sleep like a baby with a chicken, your cat. Guess I just don't meet the right girls, bud. Maybe if you weren't always blabbering about Luffy and Pepper, it's going to be you. How you don't even remember how why? Hey, chill. You don't see me bringing up your issues. <laughs> no need. My old lady keeps me fully informed of my feelings. The girl keeps notes. You mean she hasn't left you yet? <laughs> Any day now. See you around, Travis. Take it easy. 10-4. Catch you later, buddy. Huh? Hey, come back! Right, guys, welcome. This is the original Silent Hill. I thought to go back in time a little bit because I've been wanting to play some of the classics I used to play when I was younger. To be quite honest, it's been so long, I don't even remember the first one. So, this is gonna be interesting. We'll see.
made it. We have made it. Not fire. It's smoke. My God. Someone's in there. Right, it's time. Let's see what happens. A little bit unsure of where I have to go. As I said, it's been many years since I've played this, so we shall see. Because I can barely remember. The one thing I can't remember though is, I mean, this is something I don't think I've ever said, but Silent Hill is pretty much my favorite horror movie I've ever watched. It's a classic for me, I love the first one. The second one was amazing as well. And oh my goodness gracious me. You're coming with me. That is terrible. Poor innocent child. in this situation, I'd probably try and do my best to save her as well. By golly, I would have at least tried to... Fair play, he landed that quite well. Now the music's kicking in. What have we got planned? This is a thing, as I said, I have no idea. I don't remember anything. Hopefully with me saving this girl, you know, the things won't be as brutal to me. I can't remember what the logo means or the symbols and that, but it's a bit dark and on some dodgy stuff, but yes, it's one of that. Right, hopefully we'll be safe once we get out. Oh, okay, there's more to it. Because I at least want to be able to save this little girl and help her. I'm hoping that it isn't ending terrible for her. As I said, I, I can barely remember. So let's... Safe now. Hey! Someone help her! Where is... everyone? Where am I? Silent Hill? What happened last night? That girl. Did she make it? They would have taken her to the hospital. 
Coot Street. I need to see if she's okay. Okay, so at least we're not too far. That's good. Hopefully the girl is safe. We need to try our best to keep our wits about us because Silent Hill is not a safe place, obviously. But it's one of them, it's the fact is, is he dreaming or is this real? But I think I was going to say, uh, I don't know if this is based off a true story. Obviously, the entities and creatures are not real. But I think I heard something about the story. I remember when I was really big into the movies and that, and I remember hearing about something that uh, it's based off some sort of real place where something happened in a city or in, in some town of some sort and something like this happened where they caved in and it was yeah it was terrible like there's something down on the ground and there was a fire continuously going like there was an, like even technically for years and years and years there's a fire going uh, I think something about half the town collapsed of some sort got the hospital on that hmm. let's see doctor's office examine room medical room restroom hmm. kitchen staff lounge conference room ok so we've got some rooms upstairs I'm guessing Intense care, maybe. Um, we'll figure it out. We'll just have to go into every room. Well, there's no one here. I guess the best thing I could possibly do was. Oh, save. Okay, let's save. It's always good to make sure that we save. It definitely comes in handy. Fantastic. Wait, I just realized what that is. <laughs> Dodgy symbols again. It's locked, okay. The fact that there's no one here, you'd be questioning what's going on. The lock is broken, I cannot open the door. Maybe, possibly, oh, the bathrooms. Seems jammed, I can't open a door. Any information? It's pointless going into a restroom right now. She's having uh, intensive care. And that is another thing as well I do love about this game is the fact is the music. I fell in love with the music, and I think that's where I get my inspiration from. Some of the weird music I do, because I do a lot of strange style of music. I think my music's quite different compared to like normal music. I mean, obviously, I do the basic rock and that, but then I like to change it up. Hey, you a doctor? Can I help you? That fire last night. The girl who was burned. Is she here? A girl? We've received no new patients in the last day or so. Was she hurt? She was burned all over. Are you a relative? What did you say her name was? I don't know her name. I was the one who saved her from the fire. She must have been brought here. Is there another hospital? I'm sorry. Perhaps someone in reception could help you. I have urgent business to attend to. Goodbye. to the second floor. Maybe we should check to see where he's going. Let's follow. The 
Let's go to the second floor. We'll try all the floors and then hopefully we'll try the second and if there's nothing there, we'll head up to the third floor. What is this? I mean, at this point you'd question what's going on, especially the giant gaping hole in the street. Yes? You okay? Yeah, oh dear. Surely she'll be gone. I'll go into the other room. I don't know if she's gonna follow me. She might do. But at this point you'd be questioning a lot of information. What did I say? Oh, okay. I love how they do the reflection in other words in this game, in the classic game, of, um, it's pretty much another room, but it's like a copy of you in the game itself, but it's, it's weird how it works, but we're gonna go out, she's gonna be still there. Girl from the fire. How did you? I'm seeing things. This ain't right. I'm stunned to think. Oh no! It's happened. I've just, it's transformed into the other world. defeat them. I don't think you can really kill them. It's more like knock them out. Can I get through here? No. I don't think there's much of a rumble in this then. She's probably already up and after me. The sounds always made me so on edge this game. I remember that I used to panic all the time because just one thing that Silent Hill did was they used the sound so well, like the sound effects and music are just perfect. See, you hear that? The machinery. It's like instant panic, like what's happening, what's coming. Because you don't know if something's coming your way or something's following you because with the camera angle, they make it a bit of a near enough possible to really see what's around the corner. You'll only know until it attacks you, or it just comes running at you. Oh, oh dear, you see that? It's the way you look at the camera angle that kind of catches you off guard. I know they're doing some remasters of Silent Hill, which I would like to try, but as I said, I'm the classics. Okay, here we go. There is a death mark on the door. On the is is words which read even the blind have need of eyes if they wish to gaze at the shadow. 
Oh shit. As I said, these things are unpredictable. They will come out of nowhere and you just have to hope. I can't read quick enough, but let's get out of here. Oh shit. I mean, oh dear, what's this say? There is no uh, over depressed in the door. It's even in the infirmary from out of the flames, I saw life born anew. Sorry, but I'm gonna have to start swinging for you at this point. It's a shame I broke it. Alcohol bottle. Um, I think I might have to. Oh, what's this? Right. We might be on the way. Can I keep going? No. Where's the map? Where do I have to go? Oh dear, hang on. Wait, no. I, I need to remember the buttons. It's been so long since. Okay. So I'm at the stairs. But there's no other way around here. If I go through here. I can't get in there or oh, that well this is a ghost hood so I don't think I tried but there's this location here. So left and straight on. She'll probably be ready to attack me. Oh no. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. They seem to be very strong as well. I mean, this is some truck driver, this is. I mean, as I said, there is no way to really for them to die, I don't think. I'll probably have to knock her out again. Oh, hang on. This is the thing with the Silent Hill games, I always remembered it was just like an endless, like, you go here and here and here, but you're gonna have to backtrack and go here, and it's like, oh my days, and it'll just be puzzles on puzzles, and sometimes you'll think, oh, do I have to go back, to this? is this the way I have to go, it was always, always a continuous, endless, like, loop, it felt like, like, it was always so unpredictable. Now that I've already explored that, I'm gonna go back and go into the elevator. I think it's best if I do so. I got a hammer. Okay. Right, hammer time. So, I couldn't really go anywhere else. I can't remember where I came from. Hang on. No. No. Here we go. Now these are all the rooms. Now... Here. What is that symbol? That was where I came from. But I haven't came along here yet. I have to continue into these rooms here. But as long as I have a hammer, I'll be alright. I can handle the basic nerves that comes at me, but there's going to be times where... I got a golden egg. Looks like something from Pokemon there. What's this? Okay, worry not. Blank, 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 blank. I have used the blank to contain her power. No one will come to find her aid. One of the five hidden them. Um, okay. 
So, if I can remember rightly, the, obviously this little girl has some sort of ability, some sort of strange power, which is terrifying to these people, potentially, probably scares them. It's why they do these things to this girl, which is disgusting. And as we go along, we just bump them on the head. Okay. Now we go in here. Okay, maybe not. We shall go in here now. Or if I just... I've just retraced my steps. Why did I do that? So she was following me. I had a feeling she was following me. So I mean. Okay, the door is jammed. Okay, next one. Here we go. I feel like this is the same room. Yeah, it's the same room. Does it, I don't think I have a run button, so... That's uh, the question, but she's probably going to be back again. Oh dear. I really need to be careful. There we go. We need to get on the ground again. I wish I had that the, um, hammer again, but obviously the hammer breaks so easily. Okay, now that she's down, we can move on. I just wish that there was a, you know, more chance to kind of run away. I wish I could run. No, it's blocked. Okay, the last room of the area. Once I've checked this, then I'm probably going to... What is this? Okay, let's read this. Hopefully it's information that will help. This heart of mine troubles me with it. Trembling to stirring it, I have put it on ice and locked it away. Remember the free who cursed it to pump for the key. Mm. That is crazy. We got. that will help me it's a take a look yes now what could it be I thought I unlocked it then. I'm trying to think what could it be. What number could it be? I need to find the number. This is the difficult part about this game I always remembered was because it's very... There's a lot of puzzles. You can't really run in the game. And you can't really kill these things. These entities. The best I can do is probably knock her down. But how long does it take she dis till she decides to attack me? There we go. She really is going in. Right, now I need to see if I can warp back into the original world because... Where am I? Okay, I'm going back through here. Let's go. Oh, we ready? Okay, here we go. I knew she'd come after me. Maybe after once we've completed the first one, we'll jump on the second one. But I'm 
being honest, I think the first movie is my favorite. See, that's what the sound is, which sounds like machinery, but it's not. It's her body contorting and everywhere. There's something here I think that we can take. Uh huh. Got a health drink. I had a feeling it was a health drink. Let's see if we can warp back into the. There we go. I had a feeling, I was thinking, I think you can warp back. But obviously, I think they're still going to be there. Um, but I think the next thing for me is to find these numbers and collect the heart. And I don't know why, but I think that might be the next thing. Right. Obviously, she's going to be out there still. Oh, hello. Oh, my dear. My darling. It's not very nice what you do. It very much hurts me. It pains me to see that I have to do these things. Oh, okay, so I can't go through. I'm trying to think, maybe I should go to... Hmm, the third floor. Can I leave? That's the question. Can I leave? Okay, if I can leave, then that means I know that I can go to other floors. I think the basement will probably be the last place we're going to go. And then back down to... That's strange. So I can only go back to the first floor. I can't go to the third. And I don't think there's anyone in reception, even though we said go to reception and speak to someone. Unless they've respawned, I have no idea. Oh, do we go in here? I think this is where... Oh, okay, so... We're going to different places here. Exam room. It's locked, obviously. Telephones. Oh, here we go. The front desk. Surely there's some information here. Now, I know I can obviously probably... Go outside and then... I just wish that there was a running button. I think, um, wait. No, there's no running button. Uh, that would be nice. I wonder what it'd be like if I modded this game. Yeah, because I've modded a few games. I feel like Silent Hill mods would be just crazy. I don't think the um, original one could have. Definitely not. I mean, I think maybe in the remasters, obviously, for like PC and that, whatever it will be out on, you'll probably be able to mod it a little bit easier, but mm, not this one. It was more based around cheats and that, but let's go to the basement. I can't go to the basement. I can only go to the second floor. Now, in other words, I have to be in the warped world for it to work by the looks of it, so I'll probably have to fight her off again a few times. Hello there, my dear. How are you today? I'm sorry I have to do this. Okay, there we go. She's gone now. Now, that area's blocked off. And when I walk into this, we'll warp into the other world. Obviously, it's clear there. What is that? I just got body parts, human flesh, 
So I'm starting to think that just maybe... Do we have to put it back together? Did they harvest her body parts? It's getting ridiculously gory at this point. As I said, I'm struggling to remember any of this. Because it was so long ago, it's, I mean, once you've played as the same amount of games as I've got, you know, the same amount of games I've played, then you kind of struggle to remember all games now. Obviously, there's something here I need to figure out, you know, them special doors down them stairs. That's got to be potentially the way I've around or to know the knowledge of what I need to know. There, you've all got locks on, I can't get in. Another one that's blocked and I believe that I'm about to get slapped again. And then... Oh, I wasn't expecting to see the police van drive past. I turn and all sorts of police slowly driving, looking in. Okay, this is where I get a little bit confused. Because surely it keeps going, does it not? No, it doesn't. Now, this is where I need to pull out the map. Okay, let's pull out the map. So, right here, that area's blocked off. Okay. Now, we have a point of interest here, which obviously it takes us to the lobby. But it's really difficult now I'm thinking do I have to do something to go into the other go back into the other world and go to the lobby and open a door? That maybe might give me access, but then here the girls toilets. Maybe there's a way for me to maybe there's something in there for me to collect. I don't know. It could be another body part or it could be the numbers or the code for the Heart itself. There's, but the thing is, I don't remember. I remember coming out, and obviously there was a door there. And there was a door of interest here that might be actually that door. But the thing is, these are doors of interest, but I can't get through. There's no way for me to get through. What is this? Oh, here we go. Now, I'm on the first floor. I was on the second floor, which was a point of interest. Now I've tried to go into some of these rooms, but there is no way for me to get into them. Now I'm just kind of stuck in between these areas, and it's quite difficult. But there is something here that I need to figure out. There's something I need to do. Oh, hello there. I'm sorry, but you make it just as difficult for me. I'm still gonna think that she walked trying to walk away. I don't feel I can go through here, I can't. But then it brings me to this door. There's nothing I can really do. Oh, hello there. Oh dear. She's still bent on trying to destroy me. But we'll see how far we can get today. Okay, that door's blocked. Now, then there's this. Oh dear. 
at least it gives me that chance to be able to block the attack I'm kind of happy about. At least that they're quick to easily knock down, but still, I feel like I'm missing something. Is there something on her? Oh dear. Because I don't think you can completely destroy them. Oh, you can. You can completely defeat them. I didn't know you can do that. You just have to keep attacking them. I... Well, I spent a lot of time. So the door is broken. I cannot open this. I will figure this out as soon as, soon as I possibly can. I feel like this is where I need to put the body parts. Is this where I put the heart and the lungs, maybe? There's something blocking it. I cannot open the door. What has this next to again? I believe this is near the lobby. One second. Opposite the lobby. No. That is a restroom. This is the thing that's really confusing me right now is the map. So I came from there. I can't get through there, but then there's another point of interest here. This is really difficult. Unless I take the stairs. I might have to actually go back. I might have to go back, guys. I might have to go back into warp into the other world. And once I walk and warp into the other world, I can take the elevator back down to the first level. And then if I, let's say, because there's a door that will take stairs, because there's no other way. But the thing is, I don't know the code to the heart. I'm thinking I need the heart for some, but I can't get the code. I'm thinking potentially it could be But that's the basement though. The elevator doesn't work to the basement. No, they're not. That man we saw get in. He's no one to be seen. Is there a way to walk back into reality? I'm kind of happy I don't have to worry about her attacking me. There's no option for anything, unless... Oh, I did not know I could use that for a weapon. Or that. That is, that is different, okay. That is very unique. Let me see, let's, let's see what we have. Let's see what information we have right now. Okay, melee. Um, items I have a radio. Lucky. Okay. Plastic lungs. Some modeled lungs. Okay, so it's plastic. I thought they were real. They could be another potential um, puzzle. Right, okay. Notes. Here we go, here we go. So we've got notes here, let's read these notes. What's this say? Three third degree burns. The patient is unconscious. Something has her something has So she is here. Okay, so she is here. There's a possibility that we can see her, potentially save her. That's what I'm hoping for. Okay. Her in 
internal organs that are damaged, which is obviously signs of her abilities of being able to handle what has happened. I, oh yeah, yeah, we've seen that one. I think the blood note we've seen. Yeah. So she has came here. What is this though? This is the thing I'm trying to figure out. Maybe, just maybe. Can I go any higher? That's what I'm thinking. These stairs take me to the third floor because obviously I could go down to the first. No, I don't think I can. I'll defeat this one now. Just get her out of the way because it'd be a lot easier to be able to explore without having to worry about getting attacked by... Oh, there she is. Hello there. Just keep defeating her. That's all I have to do is keep knocking her out and then wait till she gets back up. Okay, she's gonna mess around a little bit. The old nudge. Whenever she feels like it. There we go, we'll do it again. Okay, she's gonna jux, you know, just shake a bit. Because it'd be a lot easier for me to kinda explore without having to keep kinda avoiding them or having to stop. Okay, hopefully this is the last time. That's it, okay. Okay, something is jumping. We can't get in. Now, the lock broke, I cannot open. But let's go explore this place a bit better. Just so we have a bit more range, as I said, you know. It's a bit hard to kind of pay attention because when I come out of a room, I'm like, okay, where's the camera panning me out now? You know, where am I looking towards? Where's the point of interest? Do I take the left or the right? So now that I'm out, I can see where I have to go. Come to this door, let's see if this is the thing. I just came out of a room exactly like this. They're all the same. But something might be different. There might be a mark on the wall. There could be a number. We just don't know at this point. It's just, it feels like it's unpredictable. Here we go. Okay. I can hear something moving. that is her or if it's something else. Okay, so that's the heart. But I'm trying to figure out what what is what is the code? Can we just risk it? Okay, so it's two, three, four. So I need five numbers. I need five numbers to be able to unlock it. You know, it could be anything and I don't think I could even guess. All I know is that the number seven doesn't work. Sounds like 
machinery. I don't know what kind of machinery that is. Okay, let's finish the job. I forgot about the other one. Oh dear. This is interesting so far. I mean, that must be her and her head, or their heads when they bang. I probably remember the second one more than I do this one because obviously this was the first the original one which was like a long, long time ago and as I said there's I, I don't even remember being a truck driver to be quite honest no, no they've got really big locks on them so sadly I don't think I'm going to be able to get in there I really want to get in there. There's something blocking it. I can't open it. Mm. I think this is the area where we can warp. It is. difficult sometimes because you have to check everything and kind of guess a little bit like right now I'm trying to find five, five numbers okay I can't go anywhere else there is nowhere else I can go I can't progress any, f any further so I have walked in I've gone to the area I have found place where there's heart that I can take, but I need a code. Now, I need to find something. The fact is that there is information. This means nothing to me, correct. The fact is we know she's here, which is good, which is a good sign. It's just the strange thing is I feel like I have to get... Oh dear. What is that? Oh, I did not know they were going to respawn. Oh yeah, it does make sense because one's in a different realm. So she's a little different. I mean, in real life, you would just climb over all this junk. You wouldn't warp into a different realm. That is just pure danger. You can easily go through all that. I need to start looking at the healing. Let's first defeat her, and then maybe I don't need to heal, and I'll automatically heal. Because I don't want to die, and after all this progress that I've done, you know, I've done all searched around, my map's probably updated now. And it knows what there is and what I can do. So then it leaves me to explore the first floor first a bit more. But as I said, it, it just will not take me anywhere. Okay, so we're all right now. It's still blocked. It is what it is. Now let's go down to the first floor. As I said, it's been a while since I've done much. Yeah, they are disconnected. I think I do need to heal. 
Is there anything here? No. Right, let's go to ground floor. And I want to explore every bit of the ground floor. I'm going to look at every detail, read everything, look for numbers and that. And I think I might have to heal myself because I have been damaged quite a lot. And I think this is, yeah, it's locked from the other side. The window's open. Okay. This is the thing I'm questioning if I'm missing something. Is there a room I missed? You know, is, did I walk past the number? See, this is a strange thing about it all, is the fact is, it's all locked and that's an exit. There's no putting me going out there because what I'm looking for is in the hospital, is trying to find this girl to save her. Not even the restrooms are open. You wouldn't think that they'd be closed, would you? Yeah, I still can't get through that. It's the stairs. Okay. Now this is going to be taking us to the lobby. Unless there's a place outside. Maybe there's a way outside. Is there anything here? It's just a bunch of... It's just a scene area. Uh, what is that? Oh, no, okay. Under construction. Currently the second floor and third floor of the hospital are undergoing reconstruction at this time. They are closed to the patients and visitors. Work is continuous earlier. And the hospital management, thank you for your as we try to maximize the hmm, six months complete I don't think we can wait six months to find this girl okay well I guess this information that will help um, I want to go to the room there but I'm going to save the game right now Hang on, let's first heal. Yeah, I need to heal. There we go. All right, now it's time to heal. I'm gonna save. I think we've played for about maybe f half an hour, just over half an hour. It'll probably tell me now. million hour. I think we've done long enough so far. But I don't want to drag it out because it is getting quite late guys. Can I even go outside? I can't leave until I know what's happened to that girl. So I can't even leave. This is a strange thing about this game is the fact this is the one thing that always catches me off guard is the fact is you have to really pay attention to every fine detail of this game because you could walk past something and not even notice it. And I think that's what the camera is there for, just to kind of make it that extra little bit more difficult for you. I don't know why, it just feels like it. So I have to kind of retrace my steps, make sure that I check everywhere, every crack, every corner, everything. Now, if I come through here, there's a door that says exit. I can't go outside, but yes, yeah, see, I can't even leave, even if I wanted to leave. I can't leave. But as I said, there's just things in this game that really love to make you truly try and pay attention to every fine detail. But I think we're coming to the end of it.
especially when we fall asleep nearly notice about the okay uh, yeah this is the thing that's confusing me is that there's absolutely nothing here now I can probably guess a few times of that number but my brain is not fully awake for that so right now I think we're best leaving it here but thanks guys anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed this but yeah, it's uh, something a little different and I'd like to carry on doing it. But anyways guys, have a blessed day and have a blessed night. Love you guys. See you later. And don't forget, if you enjoy this, don't forget to subscribe. Really appreciate it. Thank you.